TDM1, I think, is a marvelous drug, if I may say. You know, we've been studying the, this agent at, at Mayo for several years, so I'm very happy that many of our patients have had access to this drug as we have been conducted clinical trials. Uh, and the results that we heard uh, a few months ago on the, the EMILIA trial, uh, now uh, the data have been published in the New England Journal of Medicine, uh, really clearly demonstrating that TDM1 was better, is better, than capecitabine, lapatinib, you know, that was really practice changing. Now, certainly, uh, when the drug becomes available uh, via the FDA and, and other regulatory agencies around the world, then more patients will have access uh, to, to this uh, important agent. And, you know, having the idea of a drug antibody conjugate was really very good. You know, how can we best combine a targeted uh, anti-HER2 agent, such as trastuzumab, with chemotherapy? in a way in which we can optimize efficacy and minimize toxicity. And that's really what TDM1 does.